Hello everyone. In today's class, we are going to see how to create shapes, how to create text in Microsoft PowerPoint. And we are also going to create Hero Company logo using these shapes and text in Microsoft PowerPoint. We have lots to learn in Microsoft PowerPoint. Let me teach one by one. Now let's use this Hero Company logo as an example and explore these shapes and text in Microsoft PowerPoint. The reason behind using these kind of logos is you people should not get bored. Like when I'm explaining, this is rectangle, this is rounded rectangle and we have text tool like that. You people will be like, listen man, we know that is shape, that is text tool. Tell us what we can do with that. I won't leave you people in that stage. I believe that. In today's video, we are going to see shape options, fill color, outline color, text tool, eyedropper tool and few shortcuts like how to increase the text and decrease the text, how to duplicate a shape. So without further delay, let's start. Open Microsoft PowerPoint. Here, create a blank presentation and our new presentation site opens. Let's delete these boxes. Go to menu bar option. There, select insert. Below that, there is an option called pictures. Select the picture option and a new dialog box opens. There, we can select our pictures which we need. Let me select this image which I have downloaded. Scale the image and place it aside. Go to the menu bar section, select insert option. Below that, there is an option called shapes. Click the shape options. A drop down box opens up with lots of shapes. Here we have rectangle and rounded rectangle shape. Now we need a rectangle shape. Because in this logo, we don't have curved edges. So let's select the rectangle and create it. Drag the rectangle and place it according to the size of the shape. Now let's right click the shape. You can see an option called edit points. Select it and adjust the points according to the shape. Now let's select the shape color and shape outline color. Shape outline color is which is created in the outline of the shape. You can see that we have lots of weight options for outline and we have dashes style too. Select the option called no outline because we don't need the outline now. Go to the shape fill color and fill up the color we need for the shape. Select the shape which we created and press Ctrl plus D in the keyboard for duplicate option. And let's right click, select edit points and arrange that shape according to this shape as we did previously. Go to the shape fill option and fill the color we need. Let's move to third shape. We need a triangle shape. Create it from the shapes panel and rotate it accordingly. After that, select the shape and apply the color. Below the shape fill option, we have an option called eyedropper. Eyedropper is used to pick the color. So here we can also use that and choose the color from the image. Finally, we have created the logo using shapes through Microsoft PowerPoint. Now let's create the text. For that, go to the insert option again. You can find an option called text box. Select the text box and type the text you need. 
we won't get the exact text because I'm just showing how to use the text box in Microsoft PowerPoint. We can also select the text and change the font size, style and color. If we select the text and press Ctrl A in the keyboard, the overall text will be selected. And we can also increase and decrease the size for the text using the shortcut like pressing Ctrl plus Shift plus greater symbol or lesser symbol in the keyboard to increase or decrease the text size. This is how we create Hero Company logo using shapes in Microsoft PowerPoint. Like this, we can learn one by one about Microsoft PowerPoint in the next videos. I hope the video was useful. Thank you.